Well, let's get into some uh, some more London stuff. That's right. Yeah, we're in London, so uh, why not talk about some things London related? Yeah. So we're not sure if we're even allowed to tell you that. I think great minds just think alike. So I'm just saying it works. Cheers, Cheers bub. We've got your front row seat to the latest buzz swirling around Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey. First up, brace yourselves because Taylor and Travis are reportedly planning to set up their love nest in none other than Kansas City. Sources spill that the power couple is eyeing Travis's lavish $6 million mansion for their cozy retreat. Taylor's already putting her touch on the place, turning it into a dream home just in time for her break from the Eras Tour. But hold your horses, there's more. Despite their undying love, Taylor and Travis aren't rushing down the aisle anytime soon. Insiders reveal they're soaking in every blissful moment of their relationship, with Travis even dropping hints about Taylor in unexpected places, like his recent podcast episode where he smoothly slid in a Taylor Swift reference that had Swifty swooning. Speaking of which, Swifty struck again with a leaked snippet of Travis pouring his heart out about Taylor's down-to-earth charm sending the internet into a frenzy. And Travis's star? It's rising faster than ever thanks to his show-stopping cameo at Taylor's Eras Tour, where his charm and moves stole the spotlight. From love nests to podcast shout-outs, this duo is heating up Hollywood and our hearts. Stick around for all the tea on Taylor and Travis's whirlwind romance and more jaw-dropping celeb updates. Love Nest in KC Grab your popcorn, folks, because this is some juicy scoop. Word on the street is that Taylor Swift and her NFL beau Travis Kelsey are planning to cozy up together in Kansas City. Ahead of the football season, the superstar couple is reportedly looking to spend some quality time at Kelsey's new mansion. And we're not talking any old house. This is a swanky $6 million mansion that's about to get the Taylor touch. According to insiders, Taylor has already been busy decorating the place, making it a perfect love nest for them. Considering Taylor's flair for style, Kelsey's pad is probably looking like a dream home right now. This move is especially significant, as Taylor has a three-month break in her heiress tour, giving the couple the perfect window to nest together. Just last weekend, Taylor surprised her fans at London's Wembley Stadium by bringing Travis on stage during her concert. Decked out in a tuxedo with a tailcoat and top hat, Travis joined Taylor for a transitional sketch leading into her song, I Can Do It With A Broken Heart. In fan-captured videos, he's seen carrying her, fanning and powdering her face in a charming act that drove the crowd wild. With properties in California, Tennessee, New York City, and Rhode Island, Taylor is no stranger to luxurious homes. But it seems like Kansas City is the new hot spot for her and Travis. Will this Kansas City mansion become their new love nest? Only time will tell, but it sure sounds like the perfect setting for a fairy tale romance. No rush to the altar. All right, lovebirds and gossip enthusiasts, here's the latest on our favorite power couple, Taylor and Travis. As they gear up to celebrate their one year anniversary, insiders are spilling the tea on their blissfully happy and serious relationship. But don't expect wedding bells just yet. Multiple sources have dished that while Taylor and Travis are wildly in love, they aren't racing towards engagement or marriage. They're savoring every moment and taking things one step at a time. One source put it perfectly. They are taking things one step at a time and enjoying their journey together. Just last month, another insider revealed that Travis isn't even thinking about proposing right now. Travis has no plans on proposing to Taylor anytime soon, the source said. It's not even on his radar. Marriage is something he takes very seriously and not something he would ever just jump into without giving it some careful consideration. He's deeply committed to Taylor, but he's not rushing into anything. Despite the lack of immediate wedding plans, their relationship is rock solid. Another source shared that nobody has ever made Taylor feel the way Travis does. Taylor and Travis bring out the best in each other and lift each other up. She absolutely sees this going the distance. The first year of their romance has been described as the best year of both of their lives. Initially, Taylor worried that introducing Travis to her superstar world might scare him away, but he embraced it wholeheartedly. His attitude only made her fall even more in love with him. So while the world waits for a possible engagement, Taylor and Travis are perfectly content enjoying their journey together. Here's to more adorable moments and a future that looks brighter than ever for these two. Sneaky Swift Shoutout 
Travis Kelsey is at it again, folks. Our favorite NFL star casually slipped a Taylor Swift Easter egg into the latest episode of his podcast, New Heights. In the June 26 episode, Travis, along with his brother Jason, was broadcasting from a cozy pub in London. Barely three minutes in, Travis spotted something intriguing. The bar manager, Jesse, wearing a uniform with the number 13. Now, any true Swifty knows that Taylor's lucky number is 13. Travis didn't miss a beat, cheekily commenting, Jesse, are you wearing 13 as your lucky number? I know someone with the same one. Swift fans went wild, knowing exactly who he was talking about. Jason, ever the supportive brother, chimed in with his own 13 anecdote. I was a 13 guy, he said, reminiscing about his hockey days. But Travis wasn't done yet. With a sly smile, he added, 13 plus 87, I'm just saying, it works. Cue the collective swoon from Swifties everywhere. This is T, isn't it? Thank you very much. See what we're rocking with, hmm? Um, you put your pinky out and do it properly. Cheers. Pinky out. You put your beer like 10 feet away from yeah. you. Dude, honestly, I've never seen you and give I did. someone- That was the closest I've ever- Probably has a little- She was, at, she, she was, was she had fire to her. She was asking questions. Entire, I'm about to tear up right now. I've never <laughs> cried at a fucking- It's so cool, isn't it? Concert. Yeah. Fans flocked to the YouTube comments to gush over the subtle shout-out. One fan exclaimed, I love that Travis just slid 13 plus 87 into the conversation, while another wrote in all caps, 13 plus 87, it works, I died dead. The internet exploded with love for Travis's smooth reference, making it clear that he's got the Swifty stamp of approval. During the episode, the Kelsey brothers also recapped their time at Taylor's sold-out Eras Tour shows in London. They even chatted about meeting Prince William and his kids at the concert. Travis shared a funny tidbit about how Taylor, Prince William, and John Bon Jovi once performed together. We met royalty, guys. That's right. That's right. There was royalty at the show. I didn't, I didn't realize this because obviously we're backstage meeting him because uh, he was there with uh, little George. In yep. Charlotte. Last Your episode, Royal Highness. Last episode, I Prince think I was William. quoted as saying, F royalty. Got there early and um, and got to meet Prince William. Dude. How about that? Dude, he was the coolest mother. He was awesome. <laughs> he was so cool. He's a good dude. Wasn't sure um, if I was supposed to like bow to them, curtsy, um, just be an American idiot. But they said that um, because we weren't at like an official royal event, we didn't need to bow or curtsy. Yeah. We, like, we uh, did get warning because honestly, we don't know the actual. Yeah, we wanted to be polite, especially on this side of the yeah. If we would have been like an official meeting of royalty event, then it would have been that. Swifties strike again. Swifties never fail to amaze. This time they've been blamed for leaking a clip of Travis gushing over Taylor from his recent Bussin' with the Boys podcast appearance. In the early hours, a fan account posted the 10-minute snippet of Kelsey sharing how Swift won him over by attending his first Chiefs game with his family instead of opting for a VIP suite. The first game she came to with the Bears, I was like, I can set you up with everything, and she just walked in. She was like, I just want to be around the family and friends and experience this with everybody. And I was like, she got points for that. I was like, damn, she's in the madness and wants to support me. She really won me over with that one. Naturally, the clip went viral, but podcast host Will Compton wasn't thrilled. He tweeted his shock, suggesting the Swifties had infiltrated his cybersecurity system. Absolutely no clue how this got leaked. We are working to get the episode up shortly, but the Swifties have infiltrated our cybersecurity system, he posted. First game she came to against the Bears. I could probably set you up with everything, and she just walked right through the front door. And he was like, hey, what's... What the f is this? It was like something about me and Taylor. It's like, hey, what the? You guys okay? You guys <laughs> all right like out that? there? Get the f off Facebook, Dad. <laughs> that's my girl. That's your girl. You know what I mean? That's that's, that's my lady. So it's it's like I'm proud of that. Really fall for was how genuine she is around just like friends, family. She's in the she's in the madness, man. She wants to be a part of it. She wants to support me and do things like that. She got buku points for that. I was like, damn. She's just. I was like, man. She uh, she really won me over with that one. Travis wins Taylor's heart. Taylor Swift is over the moon these days, and it's all thanks to her beau Travis Kelsey, who's not holding back when it comes to expressing his love. Recently, Travis made waves by opening up about his feelings for Taylor while subtly throwing shade at her ex Joe Alwyn, who preferred to keep their relationship under wraps. 
Insiders reveal that Taylor is absolutely smitten with Travis, who is proving himself to be Taylor's guy through and through. Not only does he gush over her music, a trait adored by Swifties worldwide, but he's also defending her honor by taking digs at Joe Alwyn's secrecy. Travis is the opposite of Joe, shared one insider. He's loudly proclaiming his love for Taylor, and she couldn't be prouder. She sees a future with him and loves that he's not afraid to show their relationship to the world. It seems Travis Kelsey is not just a star on the football field, he's also scoring major points with Taylor Swift by being open, supportive, and unapologetically in love. Looks like these two are headed for a touchdown in love. Travis Kelsey's Star Rises Travis isn't just making waves on the football field anymore, he's now a bona fide star in the world of pop culture, all thanks to his relationship with Taylor. Kelsey's recent appearance on Swift's Eras Tour at London's Wembley Stadium has catapulted his Instagram following to new heights, gaining over 100,000 new followers in just a few days. During the show, Kelsey didn't just blend into the background, he stole the spotlight in a dapper tuxedo, top hat and bow tie, performing alongside Swift during the introduction to her hit, I Can Do It With A Broken Heart. His energetic dance moves, playful interactions with Swift, and even a theatrical moment where he lifted her onto a sofa all contributed to the buzz surrounding his cameo. Social media analytics have shown a significant surge in Kelsey's popularity, marking a milestone in his rise to international fame. This surge comes as no surprise, considering the global appeal of Taylor Swift and the curiosity around her relationship with the Kansas City Chiefs tight end. Kelsey's newfound celebrity status isn't just confined to football fans anymore. He's now a recognizable figure worldwide, resonating beyond NFL circles. As his Instagram continues to grow, it's clear that Travis Kelsey's star power is on a trajectory that shows no signs of slowing down. That's all for this video, folks. We'll see you next time.